Your Storm Tracker 22 forecast, certified most accurate by Weather 8. Let's take a live look across the area. We've got some clouds outside. You can see it downtown Savannah. They're out at Harbor Town. You can see the cloud coverage as well. Well, that's helped keep us a little bit milder. We get the mid 60s at the coast. Light breeze coming in out of the east along the sea, but you don't see it there at Garden City. You do see the clouds though, and those temperatures, well, they have cooled down. They're better than the 40s we were waking up in yesterday, but still cooler than the upper 50s where we should be, unless you are closer to that coastline where we see the 60s. The rest of us heading out the door, a little bit of a chill, but feeling milder. Now that breeze, it's not too much, but it'll be out of the east day, five, 10 miles an hour. And along the coastline, you can expect it to be a little bit stronger. So if you are getting out to the coast today, maybe you want to soak up some sunshine, get your steps in, maybe take your dog up to Hilton Head and enjoy Caligny Beach. We're going to have those upper 60s, low 70s across the coast. Now the breeze, like I said, it'll be out of the east, 10, 15, maybe even 20 miles an hour at times. If you did want to get into the water, now that that temperature is in the upper 60s, low 70s, just know the rip risk is going to be elevated today into tomorrow. So that is something you have to keep an eye on. But the clouds that we have right now, they're going to thin and it is going to be a gorgeous afternoon. Take a look at Futurecast. I'm just speeding right through it because we keep a lot of sunshine around today, tomorrow, all the way through the weekend until our next front approaches on Tuesday. Now this one, as it comes in, we will see those rain chances, but yet again, look at what happens as it comes in from the west. You're going to see it starting to fall apart. So right now, just put a little 20% out there for us next week, and we do need that rain. We are five inches below average, but no rain today, just sunshine and milder temperatures, but still very comfy. You'll have those upper 70s and out at the coast. You're going to see low 70s to upper 60s. If you're at Hunting Island to Hilton Head, those temperatures right around 70 and then you get inland and we'll see those mid 70s coming back into play. Mid 70s don't last too long though. That average high is officially in the 80s and we're going to be in the 80s as we head into the weekend with hardly a cloud in the sky for Saturday and Sunday both Emma. So if you got weekend plans, make sure you go ahead and pack that sunscreen. It's looking fantastic. All right.